Hey everyone, welcome back to the WA Electronics channel. Today, we've got an exciting unboxing and review for you. We're going to be taking a look at the Bacon BK969S Soldering Station, a popular choice for electronics enthusiasts, DIYers, and professionals alike. This station promises precision, efficiency, and durability. So we're going to unbox it, check out its features, and see if it lives up to the hype. So, without further ado, let's dive right in. All right, so let's start with the unboxing. The Bacon BK969S comes in a clean, well-packaged box. Nothing too flashy, but sturdy enough to protect what's inside. Let's crack it open and see what's included. Inside the box, we've got the soldering station itself, nicely wrapped in foam to keep it safe during shipping. Then, we have the soldering iron with a standard tip already installed, a sponge for cleaning the tip, an iron holder stand, a user manuals, and of course, the power cord. Looks like we're good to go. Everything you need to get started is here, and it looks well-built so far. Let's take a closer look at the station and the Aaron. The Bacon BK969S has a sleek, compact design. The body is made from solid plastic, which feels durable. It's got an LCD display that shows the temperature in both Celsius and Fahrenheit. The buttons here let you adjust the temperature with fine precision, up to 480 degrees Celsius. One cool feature I've noticed right away is the temperature memory function which means it'll remember the last temperature you used when you power it on again. The soldering iron itself has a comfortable grip and it feels really lightweight. This is crucial for long soldering sessions because it reduces hand fatigue. The tip is replaceable and there are a variety of compatible tips you can use depending on the job you're doing. Let's fire this up and see how quickly it heats up. I've set it to 350 degrees Celsius, which is a pretty standard temperature for most soldering jobs. And there we go. It's already heating up. The BK969S uses a fast heating ceramic core, so it's designed to get to your desired temperature really quickly. That was impressively fast less than 20 seconds to reach 350 degrees Celsius. Now, let's put it to the test with some soldering. Soldering with this iron feels smooth. The temperature remains consistent throughout the process, which is important for avoiding cold joints. The temperature stability is great so far. It doesn't fluctuate wildly when you're working, even on larger components that require more heat. The soldering tip gives a good balance between precision and surface area, making it easy to work on small components without struggling to heat them properly. So, after testing the Bacon BK969S, I have to say, I'm impressed. For its price range, this station offers a lot of features you'd expect from higher-end soldering stations. The fast heat-up time, temperature stability, and the comfortable soldering iron make it an excellent choice for both beginners and more experienced users. Plus, the temperature memory feature and easy-to-read display add a level of convenience that's hard to beat. If I had to point out one thing, 
it would be the lack of included extra tips in the box. You might want to invest in a few additional ones depending on the types of projects you work on. But other than that, this is a solid soldering station that I definitely recommend. So that's it for today's review. I hope this unboxing and hands-on test helped you get a good idea of what the Bacon BK969S can do. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more tech reviews, tutorials, and DIY projects. Drop a comment below if you've got any questions or let me know if you've used this station yourself. You can found buying link in description below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.